You're listening to Daily Man of Devotional. Thanks for stopping by. Glad you're here. If you're new to the channel, welcome, welcome. Me and Mia are very happy that you joined us, aren't we? <laughs> Thanks for coming. Make sure you hit the subscribe with the <laughs> notification. That's right. You got to hit that notification bell. Uh, you can hit the thumbs up if it feels so inclined. You can comment. You can shoot me an email at dailymanamedia uh, at uh, gmail.com if you have any kind of prayer request or just something that's going on with you or something you're going through. Uh, shoot me an email. That's the best way to reach me in a good amount of time because I don't check the comments each and every day as they don't pop up on my phone. So if you need to reach me, shoot me an email. Um, and there I will be able to uh, get your prayer requests and things in a timely fashion. Okay, uh, the title of today's devotion is Accountability. So let's jump over into that. Accountability. How does accountability help me avoid foolish mistakes? God's response. You're accountable for this decision, Joshua said. You have chosen to serve the Lord. Yes, they replied. We are accountable, Joshua 24, 22. Fools think they need no advice, but the wise, but the wise listen to others, Proverbs 12. 15. There are probably some dark corners in your life, secret habits and private thoughts that, d that you don't want anyone to know about. If those were exposed to the spotlight of God's truth, you know you would have to deal with them, even give them up. Accountability means answering to someone who will ask you to give an account of your words, actions, and motives, even the ones in the dark corners. Accountability can be painful in the short run, but the lack of it will destroy you in the long run. Your secret sins will eat away at your character and integrity until your reputation crashes around you. Rarely do you see it coming. Determine now to find a wise friend or mentor to keep you accountable. Don't let the darkness take over your heart. That's right. God's challenge. Share each other's troubles and problems and in this way obey the law of Christ. Galatians 6.2 this devotion comes out of from a devotional by Tyndale. All right. That's a good one too, right? Accountability. Hope you're having a wonderful morning. Have a great rest of your day. And as always, God bless. We'll see you in the morning.